what am I talking about? The insane range that uh, manufacturers are saying about their bikes. Like, really? But some of these bikes, like 36 volt battery with 15 amp hours, right? Um, that's like not even 500 watt hours. And they're saying that it goes like 90 miles or something, like really? You're gonna hear a little bit of background noise and that's because I have the air on. It is what it is, you know what I'm saying? All right, so um, let's take a look at Super 73, what they say, okay? They say it goes 40 to 75 miles, which is deceiving. You might be able to get 75 miles if you're pedaling like a Banshee in uh, Pedal Assist 1 or uh, Mode 1. Um, and, uh, you know, it's not using a lot of battery power, so that's possible. But they don't really say that. They should say that right here. But they do kind of say it down here a little bit. Uh, let's see, where did they say it? 75 plus miles of range using Class 1. All right, so, I mean, they're, they're being legit. I still think 75 is a bit much, um, but um, I tell you, you're not getting much more than like 25 if you're using the highest um, performance level, like level three, whatever it is, and throttle only, you're not gonna, you're only gonna get maybe 25. But yeah, you put it in the lowest setting, it's not using a lot of battery, and you're getting um, pretty decent range. So okay, fine. Okay, let's take a look at Ad Motor. Um, they, I actually did a video recently of some bikes um, that kind of compete with Super 73, and this was one of them. The Hero Tan M65X. Looks like a badass bike. 48 volt, 20 amp hour. So exactly what a Super 73 has, right? And let's look down here where it tells you. Pedal Assist 1, which, I mean, who's gonna ride it in Pedal Assist 1 for long? You're gonna be dead. But anyway, 105 miles. Really? In Pedal Assist 1, bullshit. I mean, maybe, maybe 50 miles. Right, 105 miles, bullshit, okay? No freaking way. All right, let's take a look at Aerial Rider and their very popular X-Class. Um, it has a 52 volt battery with uh, 20 amp hours, so 1,040 watt hours. Um, it's saying up to 75 miles per charge. Um, I mean, if you're not, if you're using the, the lowest, if you're using, it only has like probably one gear, maybe it has multiple gears. Okay. If you're using the lowest pedal assist level and the lowest, you know, electric, electric uh, mode they have, maybe 50. I mean, come on, 75. Come on. I mean, Jesus, fudge. This is such bullshit, people. That's huge exaggeration. No freaking way. All right. Let's look at uh, a Venton. And uh, their Cinch, one of my favorite bikes of all time. I own this as well. It has a 48 volt, uh, what does it say? Hold on, I'll give you specs right here. 48 volt, 14 amp hour. So 672 watt hours, very common uh, capacity. And they say it goes 30 miles. If you put this thing in pedal assist one, um, and you're on flat, maybe, maybe 30 miles. It's a stretch, but at least it's legit. I mean, they're not like saying 50 miles, you know. Um, they should say in Pedal Assist 1, but you know, they're a little misleading, but they're not bad, okay? So um, overall, I'm not pissed off, but they should say in Pedal Assist 1, okay? Or Mode 1. All right, let's take a look at Iahora. Uh, they have a bunch of different bikes you may have heard of. I just picked one. Uh, they're urban, and it has a 48 volt, 11.6 amp hour battery. Throttle only. I'm going to say 20 miles and 20 miles max. Um, again, a Super 73 has 20 amp hours, so I mean, yeah, 20 max, I think. Um, but they actually don't lie too much. Uh, they say, where do they say? It? Right here, 20 to 20, 24 to 25 miles. On throttle mode, I mean that's a that's a stretch. At least I'm not saying like 60. Um, so they're like you know a good five or six miles over on that one. And then 48 to 51 on pedal assist mode. Yeah, pedal assist one maybe, but who's pedaling this shit all the time? So I don't. Know. I mean not bad. They're not they're not they're not terrible. Okay. All right, people, we're taking a look at an Eco Trick. And uh, 48 volts, 17.5 amp hour, so 840 watt hours. And look at this. This is freaking badass. 
they say 22.7 to 25.7 miles pure electric and then 43 to 46 pedal assist like that's badass they should probably say at some point or maybe they do how much those people weigh and what the terrain is but yeah that's about right people that's freaking cool and they're doing this based on this range based on weight based on uh terrain etc wind so i mean yeah that's about right so god bless these freaking folks good for you guys all right let's take a look at the angway m20x i just had one of these uh angway angway m20 uh, i just had one of these it says 47 miles let's let's imagine that we don't see that because down here they have much better uh, specs okay they save it 26 amp hours total so it's 213 amp hour 48 volt batteries um, and it's saying that you can get 34 miles on electric mode one plus or minus five I agree that's not bad at all so um, God bless you guys you're actually telling the truth the Himaway Cruiser another bike I've owned um, it has 840 watt hour battery so it's like a 48 volt 17 and 0.5 amp hour <clears throat> and it says it can go up to 60 miles per charge on pedal assist mode not true and 35 miles on pure electric mode there's just no way um pure electric mode um 25 so they're they're big inflated too i mean not grossly but pretty big and then 60 miles on pedal assist one maybe i mean come on that's still just not right i mean it's 35 miles right 40 miles 60 miles bullshit all right let's take a look at the uh the jack rabbit this is like a really 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 freaking light little bike i've seen it i've ridden one and um doesn't say how big its battery is but i believe i remember at electrify expo when i asked the guy he said it was like <clears throat> 36 volt five or six amp hour something like that <clears throat> so like 150 watt hours like really freaking small but god bless these people they say 10 miles range, and that's about freaking right. So um, huge thumbs up to them for legitimacy, people. I like it. I like to hear that kind of stuff. All right, let's take a look at the very, very, very popular Jetson Bolt. This is the one that's in um, it's in uh, Costco, and I've owned this one, and I own the uh, the Pro as well, their upgraded version. Um, it has. It says it goes 15 miles. It has a where is it? 36 volt, six amp hour. So there's a 216 watt hour. I think it's the smallest battery I've ever seen. Um, it's gonna get eight to 10 miles, but the fact that they say 15 is not a huge exaggeration. I mean, if you're 60, 70 pounds and it's flat and there's wind behind your back, maybe. So it's not a gross exaggeration, but it's an exaggeration. But still, I mean, I'll give them a pass. This is a, at least in the, in the decent range of possibility, okay? So there you have it. All right, let's take a look at Juice Bikes and their Rip Racer, which again, I also owned. See, I'm like using a lot of bikes I've owned. I know this shit, people, trust me. This has a 52 volt battery and um, let's see. I had the 15 amp hour, so that's like 811 watt hours, which isn't a lot. And um, it's saying 55 mile range. Let's say you're in pedal assist one. Um, I actually rode it in pedal assist one for a while. I'm gonna say maybe 35 miles. So they're they're really inflated here too. 55, that's bullshit. No way. All right, we're gonna take a look at the Rad Power Bikes, uh, Rad Runner 2. I actually own this bike, that exact bike. And let's see what it says. Um, it has 672 watt hours so that's 48 volt 14 amp hours um and it's saying 24 25 to 45 miles per charge it doesn't really say what pedal assist level and all that you're in but let's see if it says somewhere else uh no okay i mean that's not a huge exaggeration um if you're in pedal assist one you know the lowest mode it's flat you're kind of light maybe 25 miles I think 45 is a bit much, uh, especially if you're gonna even touch the throttle. So, not gross exaggeration, not bad. I'll give them a pass, okay? All right, let's take a look at the Swagtron, the EB7 Plus, another bike that I've had. Um, it doesn't actually tell you the size of the battery, but I can tell you that it's about 
a 36 volt, 8 amp hour maybe. So what is that? 36 times 8. 280 watt hours. Um, it says it can go 20 miles, uh, throttle only. That's not true. Um, pedal assist, you can probably get 18. Throttle only, you're going to get about 12, maybe 14, and then it's going to die on you. So not a huge exaggeration, but uh, I'm not sure. It's still a little inflated, okay? All right, let's look at the V-Volt Centauri. I actually own this bike, right? And it's got like a 36 volt, nine amp hour battery. And I think it says it has, where does it say? Uh, like 375 watt hours. So yeah, about a 36 volt, nine amp hour battery. And this one is actually legit, 15 miles. That's about right. And that's when you're pedaling pretty good. 40 miles, I mean, yeah, if you're like four pounds and you've got really long legs and you're, you've got a big semi behind you, sure. But I mean, I'm gonna give them a lot of credit for this 15 right here. That's legit. A lot of companies would say like 60 miles, which is bullshit. So yeah, good for you guys, all right? That's gonna do it, people. Thanks for watching. God bless. Peace out.